Today I'm going to just do a couple little things. I'm going to make cupcakes later, and right now I'm making actually going to make uh, Christmas cold like frosty frosty cupcakes. I'm right now cutting up some melt and pour that I made before blue, and then I have some white. I'm going to be punching out some snowflakes. So right now I'm cutting up pieces to to melt. I'm going to pour them in my molds, and then I'll show you how I pop them out. Okay, actually I didn't, I changed my mind, but I didn't change my mind. I'm still going to do the thing, the, the toppers for cupcakes, but I'm going to make a melt and pour soap today. But right now I'm going to just pour uh, the blue into here so that I can cut out some snowflakes. And I will show you guys after what I'm doing. So that I did some blue, and then I did some white that's going in this mold, so that I can, um, okay, so then I can cut these ones out when they set up. And then I'm going to show you guys what I'm planning on doing. I'm still going to do cupcakes, but I'm going to make a melt and pour soap because it's been a while. So I will share both of that with you. Okay, my white's not solid yet, but my blue is, and I got my little punch mold. I'm going to show you what I'm doing. This is part of the plan. So we're going to punch. Actually, I should have probably peeled that out first. Yeah, maybe I should have, but we're just going to do this. I'm just going to put it in, and I'm pushing to make it pop out the um, snowflake shape. And I will keep doing that, different sizes, and then I'll show you once I pop them out, and then I'll show you what I'm doing. There's one that I just cut out and... If I can pop it out. I think I broke it. I can't get it out. Shoot. Well, that's the dumbest thing. Anyways, I will be getting these out. I probably need a toothpick. And then, like I said, I'll show you. I'm still making these for toppers for cupcakes, but I just got this overwhelming urge to do something else. So I will do that today, and I'll show you. Okay, here's some of the snowflakes that I've... Uh, well, I tried to pop out. I didn't get them all out. So you see what I'm doing. I'm making snowflakes for this soap. And I'm going to be using the snowflake toppers for the cupcakes too. But right now I'm going to work on the soap. And I'll be back and show you a bit more. The white ones I had to put in the freezer because they weren't setting up as good as the clear. Okay, I'm back. This may prove to be an epic fail. I said I wanted to do soap today, so I'm going to attempt to do a melt and pour. It's been ages since I've done a melt and pour. And the plan here is to have... Oh, let's get a skin on it. Is to um, make like an icebergy type soap where it looks like it's melting and then... Or solid and then melting. Thawing out, I guess, is what you want to say. So I'm going to do, I guess it's a frozen theme. I guess you can call it that. I've got a couple chunks left in here. Um, that's what I want. And I'm doing this in wintergreen. It smells really good. But obviously not too much because we don't want people tingly. Some people want to be tingly. Huh. So, first step. I guess I should have made some room. Okay, so I'm going to use this mold. I've got my white with some chunks and a little tiny few pieces of blue, which I'm going to actually add in some more white chunks to give the effect of snow melting and some clear chunks in there. Give it a little bit of a stir so they kind of get you know smoother around the edges and like I said this may be a total epic fail I'm not really sure how it's gonna go but we're going to attempt it I guess I'm gonna use this and I have another spatula this one keeps getting a skin on it it's really weird okay where's my other spatula there it is so I'm going to do this mold and we're going to pour the snow part in first if you can see the there's a few chunks in there that's what I want so that's going on the bottom. 
like so. And it's not going to matter if I get other pieces in there mixed with it because I want it to look like it's merging. Like it's melting, like I said, thawing out. So we've got the clear. Actually, I could probably add some more chunks in there. Um, this is the clear. But I put a little bit of blue, a couple blue chunks in there. And actually, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to add in some white. I'm going to have to probably zap this again in a second. I told you guys I wanted to do a soap today, but I didn't, um, I couldn't do a normal soap today because kids are home and cats and all that fun stuff, so we don't, I don't need the distraction in the kitchen. I still may do it. I still may do my cupcakes too, I'm not sure, but yeah, okay, I'm going to zap this real quick and I'll be right back. I'm back. I think I might have buggered that up by adding white in there because now it's cloudy. Um, but hopefully we can still get it to work. Um, so yeah, there's chunks of whatever in there. Um, how am I going to do this? You know what? We're just going to wing it. I'm going to throw in some blue chunks, some bigger blue chunks, some more clear chunks, <laughs> some white, more blue. It's not going to be exactly the way I want it. And actually the fragrance is kind of going away. Just a couple more drops. So there's that. And obviously I have to spray on here because this is sat for a bit. So we're going to uh, spray some pieces. I'm going to put some more pieces in after as soon as I put the top thingy on. So here goes nothing, people. Like I said, this could be a complete and utter epic fail. And you guys cannot see what I'm doing. But trust me, it's going in. All right, there's all the chunky doos. Come on, Soapy. So, there's that. I may have to melt a tiny bit more clear on there, I think. So, I sprayed these. I'm going to put a few of those on top. A couple clear ones. Yeah, I'm going to get one more layer of clear on here, and then I'm going to put my, uh, snowballs in i think snowballs snowflakes so i'll be back in two seconds and show you me doing that okay i'm back i just had to zap a little bit more of the the clear and just add a tiny bit of scent to that i'm going to pick you guys up to see what i'm doing so you don't have to worry so that's the clear it's sort of a blue got a tint of blue to it because i did that and then we have to, if I can show you guys, I probably can't even show you guys. Can you guys see? Never mind the pan. <laughs> see that? That's the loaf. And I'm going to spritz the top right now with alcohol. And then I'm going to put my um, snowflakes that are sitting right here on top. And if I can't get it to work. So right now, as you can see, the loaf is already setting up quite a bit. So I gotta spray the top, spray my little snowflakey pieces. I'm actually going to throw them in here. I wasn't going to, but I'm going to. And if they melt a little bit, well, c'est la vie. Like I said, this could be a fail. It could be a good one. I won't know until I'm done. So here we go. On to the top. In they go. There goes the snowflakes. There goes the clear. I really wanted to make another soap today. Not that there's anything wrong with it, but I thought, you know what? It's so close to Christmas right now that I just don't want to make a cold process Christmas soap because I'm impatient, and I know it won't be ready, and I have not figured out the hot process thing as of yet. Well, we kind of got a few snowflakes smudged together, but we'll see what she looks like when she's cut. It should be interesting. It could be very interesting. It could be horrible, <laughs> for all we know. It could be very horrible. I'm just sticking a few of my little pieces I got in here that are... Oh. Let's see if we can't get them to stick in there. Anyways. OK, 
Okay, are you going to fit in there? Maybe, maybe not. Let's just see. So the idea, anyway, is it's supposed to look like an iceberg uh, slash melting, thawing out type thing, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, I have no idea how this is going to turn out. This is not what I had planned. Like I said, I was going to do... Um, I was going to do um, my cupcake toppers. But right now, that's what we got. That is a soap. Oh, that stove's hot from where that was. That's a soap. A, yeah. It's, I, I kind of like a frozen theme, I guess. I figure for Christmas, if I'm going to put it in the flower shop, I'm going to have it Christmassy or winter related. So anyways, that's it. And then I'll cut it later on, which will probably be just in a couple hours. And then I will show you that cut. Thanks, guys.